I think issues like poverty is something that we know of but we don't know enough. By using drama, I think it's an important uh, medium to actually translate this issue onto stage. And especially for young adults, and I think it's, a, it's the best time for them to find out more about this issue, which is very, very urgent yeah, and pressing. I'm excited about today because this topic is normally not covered in scripts we do in school. From there, I hope that they wouldn't just understand it here, cognitively, but through role-playing, through listening to stories, real-life stories, they can embody the character. They can create images of the stories. And then from there, it moves them in a different way. I've learned about how for people in poverty, it's not really their choice to be there and it's usually because of a set of unfortunate circumstances. A lot of people don't realise there's a lot of poverty going on in Singapore. Even though it's becoming more addressed now, previously, a lot of people will just assume that as long as you don't see beggars in the streets, there's no poverty happening. But I think it's very important that we have more awareness about this because there are people with real stories, just like you and me, but they are put in different circumstances. I feel it's really, really rewarding to see youths from different socioeconomic status, from different backgrounds, to work together to create theatre. Social issues is a big part of how uh, arts can help to create awareness. So it opens up uh, civic discourses. It helps youths uh, or adults to talk about issues that might not be very comfortable to talk about. Through art, there is a medium that we can go through to discuss, to negotiate, to uh, learn about each other.